Sometimes you've got a really good shot, but you want to give it that special look to make it uniquely yours. That's where the filters inside Photoshop Elements come to play. There are a lot of great filters inside Photoshop Elements. As an example, the new Graphic Novel filter lets you take a photo and give it that really cool special look. I can quickly get in here and Elements 11 gives me some presets that I just have to click and choose the one that I like the best. I actually like Painted Gray. It gives a really nice look to my photo. Now if I want to take it further, I can use any of these sliders to fine tune it to my personal preferences. And just like that, Photoshop Elements has given my picture a really unique artistic look. If I want to really take it to the next level here as well, I can just do something like change the blending mode to luminosity and I really get an interesting shot. A couple of the other options that we have are the comic filter. Again, I've got the presets where I can just pick the one that I like the most. In this case, I really love the sunny day look. So I can get the comic book look with my photos, as easy as that. And I can also get something that we call pen and ink. And in fact, these presets give you one-click access to some really fantastic looks. But if you want to make it uniquely yours, there's these sliders that you can take control and get just exactly the look that you're after. With the filters in Photoshop Elements, you can give your photos many different looks, so you can use them in many different interesting ways.